I just went to adjust my glasses and my glasses aren't there. Great, good, neat, I'm smart. Hey everybody. Welcome to another video where I do whatever I want. And today I wanna go back and play with more miniature things. I go back, I mean, cause I've done miniature videos before. That sounded weird, right? But I was like, I have played with all the miniature toys. I've done all the miniature stuff. What else miniature can I do? And then I realized I have an office. So let's play with some miniature office supply things. Ready, let's begin. Now, let me get this out of the box first. Hold on, before I do my thing. Listen, I'm a woman on the go. I am a strong, independent businesswoman. So naturally, I'm going to need a briefcase. <laughs> oh, but just you wait. How does it work? Oh! I mean, just, I could carry so many. It's technically a business card holder. You know how like people have business cards and like hand them to each other and then people act like they're gonna use it and call them. This is what this is for, but no. In my life, this is just for me and my things. To the office. Ugh. Ugh, I have so much to do today. Better check my to-do list in my briefcase. Ugh. I'll eventually get around to it. Close, close, close. I need help. Okay, next thing is just it's a it's a staple in the in the office supply thing. That's a really bad pun. It's a stapler. <laughs> Going back to school, my favorite thing to do was to always get like the mini office supply things, which included the mini tape dispenser, the mini stapler, the mini scissors that didn't cut anything, and some like erasers and pencils. That was my favorite. So I was like, I knew mini staplers existed because I've bought many of them in the past. They were all so childlike, and I am not a child. I am an adult who needs office supplies in the miniature fashion because I'm an adult. So I got this one. <laughs> this was the most adult one that I could find and you know I like it I was hoping for a black one but I think a red stapler makes a statement right okay let's let's staple something yes we're stapling post-its together that are already stuck together I don't have that much paperwork in life everything's on the computer oh these papers definitely need to go together Nailed it. More like stapled it. I, what is happening? Did you ever do stapler? Where you just like make a design out of staples? Basically as lame as it sounds. But you can't do it with a small stapler because it doesn't, it can't, it can only, oh. Wait, it's a sunset against the ocean. Hold on. Yeah, this stapler works, guys. It's a, that. You know what? This is very important documents. Should probably keep it in my briefcase. And locked up and secure. You're cute. You can stay over here with my other things. And the next one, of course, is the mini tape dispenser. Like I had to get that. Oh man, seriously. And again, this only came in like kid fashion. I couldn't find an adult version. Why are they not making miniature size of the adult versions of things? Like this is very childish. Ugh, rude. Obviously, I'm still in love with it. Why is it acting like the? It acted like you peel this up and then you can use the tape. That is not at all what is happening. Where is the end to this tape? Yes, yes, this tape is backwards. This sticky side is up. So that's not correct. I don't know what's split. Oh, this is bad quality tape. This is why I wanted an adult version. <gasps> and it comes with other colors, but I don't know if they like, the colors actually show up on the thing. They might. Let's do this. Oh, we have so many papers. Oh, whoops, I ripped that one. Time to tape it. Cut. Nailed it. More like taped it. I need to stop. I just need to stop. I have to say, this is actually my favorite kind of tape where it's like actually transparent. You know, sometimes scotch tape is just like the worst. It's like super cloudy and barely sticks to anything. This is actually my favorite kind of tape. Guess who's gonna help me wrap Christmas presents this year? You. And every four seconds I will lose you and have to do this and look all around for the tape and then find the scissors six times but not be able to find you. You know, you don't get very clean edges. Boom, 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 boom. I wanna see though if the colors show up. It doesn't look like any colors showing up. I think it's such a faint color that you don't see it. Oh, you kinda see it. See how it's blue? Let's try the green. The green's not as green. See, you can see the colors. That's lame. No one wants to see the colors. This is why you needed the adult version 
of a scotch tape. Like, just imagine a scotch tape dispenser. Just smaller. That would have been cute. This isn't cute to me, but it is convenient for Christmas. So you stay over here. Thanks, Prada. Okay, this one is not really an office supply, but it said it was for your desk. I just had to get it because I was like, I don't understand, but they're tiny and they're cute. Tiny little center blocks. <laughs> what? Why? There's a box of them. And they're like, miniature center blocks made out of real cement, which they are. And they're like, it's for your desk. So let's go find a purpose on my desk for these. <laughs> okay, I still have no idea what to do with this. He's gonna make a mess. They're very chalky. Oh, already made a cement. Get off, off of my desk. I'm gonna build a wall. Did it. <laughs> I was hoping you would hold a pencil. <laughs> Hold on. Is that impressive at all or no? All right. Ta -da! Impressed yet? It's a pencil holder. Oh, no. <gasps> it's earthquake proof. All right, so the only things that will fit in this, uh, these little holes is this pencil and it's the only pencil I have. So I don't quite know what I'm supposed to do with these. I don't know why they were an office supply. I don't know why they said they're for my desk. I mean, this is all I got right here. This, this pencil holder. What was the point of this? No, you make a terrible coaster as well. They're cute and they're tiny and they're definitely miniature center blocks, which I appreciate, they're like made out of cement, but what do I do with them? What's the point? I don't get it. Someone help me. Tax product. I mean, it's an office. I have to have a filing cabinet, right? I'm hoping this is as great as I've made it in my brain since I ordered it. Oh my God, this is huge. It's huge, but also mini at the same time. I don't know how they do it. Oh, it's made out of plastic. Dang it! I wanted it to be made out of metal. So it is way smaller than a normal filing cabinet, but it's also very large. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, thank God it came with a little filing system. And one thing though, is that it has a clock on it. I don't know why. Maybe they were like, it's not enough just to be a mini filing system. We have to sell them with something else. A clock. So let's go file something. Why is this out of order? This is out of order and I am not for it. Boom. I have nothing to put in there. <laughs> but I gotta find something. Oh, it clashes so hard with the other things on my desk. Like I kind of have a silver and wood theme going on. I'm going to paint that, don't worry about it. This section right here is just like, what is happening? Over here, it looks like I'm doing something. Over here, it's like, what's the, what's, what's going on, Rachel? What's the theme here? Don't worry, in a week and a half, you'll all be Christmas. Oh, I need my best friend's phone number. Let me check. Nope, that's not how we do phone numbers anymore. Let me just get my cell phone. I love this. If I had something to put in it. I got nothing. I know what you. Nice product. Okay, now this one was not for desk supplies, but because we live in the hip new era of mason jar everything, I got tiny little mason jars. Because right now I have some mason jars on my desk that hold like my thumbtacks and some rubber bands and paper clips. But I wanted to get smaller ones. This small. <laughs> to put I don't know what in, but we're gonna find out something. Like I got so many. Okay, these are actually shot glasses. They're mason shots. Listen, you can put other things in here. You could make this a candle. I'm just saying. So let's find things to put in these. I know exactly what I'm putting in these mason jars. This one, boom, the staples from my mini stapler. Nailed it. take anything. So basically, I got the mini jars to hold my miniature supplies. <laughs> That's what I'm doing with my life, everybody. What are you doing with yours? I was hoping my mini post-it notes would fit in this, but they don't. These ones do. Look so much better. I'm gonna store my SD cards in it. I have one. Boom. Oh, look, I'll put them. Boom. Shaka. Laka. Okay, you are just ugly. Organization is where it's at. I'm really bad at decorating. I still have more, four more Jason jars. I have no idea what to do with this. Take shots? Never. Oh God, ugh. Last, but certainly not least, I saw this and this is what sparked it all. I was like, I need to do another miniature thing because I saw this. A miniature wacky waving inflatable tube guy. If this doesn't work, I'm going to be so sad. Oh my God, the base is huge. The base is ginormous. What does this do? What are you for? What's happening? Not intended for children. 
get out of my face. This is not intended for children. Are you really telling me you made this for adults? I mean, I did buy it. I do qualify as an adult sometimes. Oh, I am pissed. It takes one of those stupid batteries you put in the smoke detector. I don't have any spare one of those. A nine volt? Never in my days do I just have a nine volt laying around. And we were pleased. I was like, you know what? I'll just take one out of the smoke detector. Gotcha, smoke detector. No, we, I can't because I replaced all the old fashioned battery smoke detectors with like these fancy ones that last 10 years and then instead of replacing the battery, you replace the whole thing and it, I have to freaking go to the store and get a freaking nine volt. This is stupid. I'm angry. I guess I'll be back. That took too long. Got the battery. Where's the thing? It's way over there. Oh no, I dropped the screw. This is turning out to be a really bad just moment for me in life. Let's see if I can do it without the freaking screw. Woo! Okay, so off. We'll put it on off real quick. If you don't work after all this, I'm gonna be really sad. Just so you know, you better work. Don't you get stuck, don't you get, don't you get stuck, don't get stuck. Ah, good. Ah, ah, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm satisfied. You're gonna have to shut off, baby. You're really right, you're very loud. It's very loud. Oh, that was sad. It's very, very loud. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm gonna say the only downside is it's very loud, except it gets stuck in the up position sometimes, which is a little confusing because don't do that. Your job is to flop. You must flop about. But I think that this, uh, this whole venture was worth it for that. It was worth going to CVS for. It was worth stupid cement blocks to fill the video void. It was worth it. It was worth it. You are my new best friend. What should I name him? Will someone help me name him, please? All right, guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed this. I just wanted an excuse to have miniature things on my desk, so I did. I will find a purpose for all of of these things. Just looking at them is their purpose. I don't know what to do with you. If you ever see uh, cute miniature things sent in my way, there's like where I can, there's pictures of them. You don't have to send me cute miniature things. That sounded weird. Uh, no, just let me know about them because I love testing them. I love trying them. I love having them. I love looking at them, feeling them, touching them. See, those miniatures are tiny. It's like a little puppy. No, puppies have a scent that you can't recreate. Puppies are the best. So are kittens. I love tiny things. Maybe it's because I'm not tiny. I am a giant, therefore anything tiny just fascinates me. Like, how do they do it? I will put a link down below to all of these things. My Amazon playlist, you can find everything there that I try in my videos. I love you guys so much. Subscribe to see videos every Tuesday and Thursday on this channel. Like this video if you liked it. Let's do a shout out. Do I even have a phone? Where is it? All right, for the person who retweeted my mystery box video is Shanna. Thank you so much, Shanna, for retweeting that. I love you guys, and remember, above all else. Stay awesome, possums.